I'm sinking in. This isn't good. This wow. is not good. Oh, that's gross. Ugh. So this is actually a river that is fed by a whole bunch of springs, crystal clear water coming out of these springs. Now, they're doing some work on the river somewhere. So they opened it up and they drained the river down lower. So we're about six feet lower than usual. So normally all of these trees that you see here, these trees are all have the water level like five feet up from here. So normally we'd be underwater, but it's all exposed now. And this has exposed some secret caves out here. So we're gonna get out here. We wanna find these caves and go in these caves because once they fill this river back in, no one's ever gonna be able to get to go in there again like we will. We're gonna have to pump up our inflatable boat and get it all the way across this marshland here. Oh. There's my shoe. This is 50 degrees and my feet are literally going numb right now. We got this thing off Amazon. It was like $200. It's basically a giant inflatable boat like a little kid would have in a pool. The reason that we need to bring that and not a regular boat is because the boat ramp is completely high and dry. The river is so far down that there's no more water at the boat ramp. So we need another way to get in the water. So this baby is gonna be our trusty steed. So here's our $200 inflatable raft. It's all blown up and it's actually pretty sturdy. I'm a little impressed. Hopefully it'll hold. Hopefully it'll get us all the way out to that secret cave. Then we're gonna jump off this raft and swim inside. Go ahead and get in the back. Who thought a boat filled with air would be so heavy? We're almost there. We did it. We're almost there. Woo! Wow. Woo! Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Woo! Oh. Woo! Yeah. Woo! This is the entrance to the cave. I do have my snorkel and my mask in case we need to get down and get under any ledges. I've got my Orca Torch D530 dive light. I'm bringing it in so we get some good lighting in there. And I've got a backup light as well because when you go in a cave, you do not want to go in with only one light. You've got to have a backup. If your light goes out, if you don't have a backup, you're stuck. This is the entrance to the cave here and check this out. Look at this huge crack up here. Once they fill this back up with water, we'll never be able to get to see this cave like this again. Wow, big crack up in here. This is amazing. We've got a lot of canoes in our way. I think we're gonna have to go around them or go under them. Wow, the water is so cool. Clear, it's amazing. Check this out here. We got some little passageways back in here. Let's see what we got back in here. Whoa. Look at this. There's some big holes up in the roof here. If I was brave, I'd climb way up in there and see what's in there. But I'm not that brave. And I don't want to tear up my wetsuit climbing up this rock like this. So let's go down here. We're going to go down the main passageway. We got pools of water in here. And we've got some small little hidden passageways. Whoa. Rich is going down here. He's free diving down in the cave already. I mean, there's just cracks and crevasses everywhere. It's amazing. Now, again, this is something that most people will never get the chance to see because this is always underwater. So this is a once in a lifetime experience and this is absolutely incredible. Look at these caves here. This is amazing. We have a lot of holes and secret passageways. Okay, we're sending Colton back because he's the smallest one of all of us. <laughs> Poor Colton, man. How far back does it go? A ways. It goes far. Yo, this is crazy. Don't get lost, guys. We've got little secret passageways here. Oh, look at this back in here. Yo, I want to go back in here. 
You guys, could you imagine if this was filled with water? How crazy this would be to get back in here if this was like all full of water? Oh, yo, guys. Whoa! Oh, oh. <laughs> oh man. Uh, well, these are the dangers of caving, but this is what we do. We need your heart pads today. To get the shots, I almost fell straight down this cave and busted my butt. But uh, my wetsuit saved me, man. I think I tore my wetsuit, but. Did you? I went down hard, man. I don't know. Well, this. My elbows went down. Yeah, hey, uh, there's a sleeping bat right here. I don't want to wake him. There's a bat? Oh, what? There's bats. Yo, there's a bat here. Yo, you guys, this is crazy. We just so get cool. deep into this cave, and Colton found a bat, man. Check this out. I didn't even see this little guy here. Look at this little guy. There's a little bat. That's a little bat sleeping up there. Yo. <laughs> we made it back to the bat cave. This is unbelievable guys i've never seen anything like this all right guys so we don't want to disturb the bats because breathing air inside of the cave where the bats are pooping can be bad for your health so don't we're gonna leave those bats alone we don't want to disturb them you guys all saw batman and bruce wayne man you remember how that turned out all right oh you guys when in doubt go right <laughs> it's only the right way all right we gotta go the right way let's check it out not the wrong way here goes nothing Oh, this is epic. I'm telling you, it's so tight, my hips almost get stuck. Oh, careful here. All right, I'm going, I'm going down, okay? Oh, you guys, this is amazing, man. There's, there's water just flowing continuously out of this cave because it's actually a spring. But we're gonna, there's some tight places in here. Oh. Hey guys, real quick, if you're enjoying this video, hit that subscribe button. Now, big passageway down here, and there's a big like river flowing out of it. It's basically spring fed. I'm gonna get down here and take a, take a look, see what this looks like underwater. Ooh. Ooh. There's a line right here. Now that line is a line that cave divers would normally follow. So cave divers go down this hole and rely on this line to get them safely back out of this cave. That is crazy. Now look up here, there's a huge, huge crack exposed in the ceiling up here. This is unbelievable, you guys. Look at this. Wow. Whoa. All right, there's the line the cave divers use. We don't want to damage that because cave divers need that to get in and out of this cave. Colton, bro, how you doing, man? Have you ever seen anything like this in your life? I have never seen anything like this in my life. What is in there? I don't know. So deep? Maybe a velociraptor. <laughs> Yo, what is that? Yo, what is that? <laughs> no, I'm just doing that for a hook. Hey guys, now we'll be on the lookout here. There could be more bats up in these cracks here. Going back in here now, look at this mud sinking up to my legs in this mud. So the spring is probably not back here. Spring's probably behind us. Oh my gosh. Yo, you guys, this cave, this cave goes way way back in there. This is a little scary, but it's very, very cool. If my batteries run out, that's gonna be a bad day, man. I'm gonna be stuck. Oh. Ow. There's a lot of hidden rocks, stalactites in here. Gotta be careful. Now look at this. Look at those holes up in there. Those are batteries for sure. Yo, what you guys find back in here? Oh. 
Rich. What's up? Rich, I got a rescue mission for your brother. What is it? I dropped my dive light, man. I dropped my dive light. Oh, no. Dude, my dive light, it's right here. It's right under me, but it's in muck. I can't see it, man. And if I lose this other light, dude, I'm stuck, bro. <laughs> right. Now listen, I'm not moving. I, I dropped the light right here. I was just trying to shut it off and I, it slipped out, man. Stupid, right, you see, this is why you don't go in caves without proper cave dive training. So, you know, bad stuff like this happens. But definitely don't go it alone. Always go with your buddies so they can look out for you. Make a deal though. <laughs> What's the deal? If we find this light, all of your subscribers will go and subscribe to Rich Aloha. Guys, please, I need some help, man. <laughs> Rich has to find this light for me, and you guys need to go to Rich's channel and subscribe right now. And also go to World of Colton's channel and subscribe right now because we're these guys are just keeping me safe in this cave, man. I'm not, I don't want to move because it's so silky, it's gonna sink down in there, bro. Okay. So very gently feel around down there, okay? Yeah, I will do I'll, I'll do my best. Yeah. Let's wish me luck, man. Right. Please. <laughs> Thanks, brother. Seriously, my knees are all the way down in the sill. So, like, if that light went down in the sill that deep, it's... I, I don't know how people cave dive in here, man. If you were to kick the silt up, dude, you lose all visibility in this cave. Like, that's insane. This, this is really dangerous when you think about it, man. Like, because if I lost that light and my other light went out, I'm just yeah. bro. Oh, I found it, bro. Oh! Yeah. Oh, much, man. Woo. Save the dive. <laughs> oh guys, I think I found the spring. Yeah. Yo, check this out. I think this is, I see fresh water. Yo, Rich, Rich. Yeah, let's Dude, see. Look at this. Guys, check this out. Yo. Dude. Oh, my I think goodness. you're right. Alright guys, check this out. We're going back in here. Look at this. Oh my goodness. I think we found a secret passage right here. Yo, this is crazy. Holy smokes, that's sick. Let me put my mask on. Yeah, just watch out for salt, for real. Yeah. Like, for real, for real. Uh-huh, Oh, it's cold. Is it cold? Oh, it's sick. Oh. Look at this. This is wild. So Rich and I got way back in the cave. We found this spring that fresh water comes out. Yeah. We are deep in this cave. Rich found a little hole here. He was free diving down in this cave. Man, this is wild. <laughs> He's going down to the cable for those spot.
Dude, how far back are you gonna go? I don't know. I'm gonna go all the way as far as I can. Let's see, wish me luck, guys. Guys, this is crazy. I'm gonna turn my Orca torch back on. Oh, this is so cool. Hey, wow. Over there is where we came in. We're way back in the cave. It's dry over here. Rich went way back in there. We found some treasure already. So I'm gonna go back over there and see what kind of treasure Rich found. Hang on, buddy. Yo, guys, look at this. We're way back in this dry cave. And the last time this thing was dry, I don't know how long ago it would have been, but we found some really, really old cans. Check this out here, look at this. This is like an antique bottle in here, man. It says Holt, Coors Banquet Beer. That's old school. Hold, hold up that bottle right there, look at that. Look at this. Dude, that's a cool old glass bottle. Yeah. We gotta take that out, man. Well, first off, curious. we're clearing trash out of here, but we gotta take that, man. That's pretty cool, that should and not then, be in here. Look, I found a necklace. You found a necklace? Or something, yeah. Oh, dude, yeah, that's dope. I don't know what that dude, is. Dude, there's a little bead necklace back in here. <laughs> we're finding <laughs> we're finding treasure in the most remote place you can get, man. This is unbelievable. This is treasure hunting at its Look finest. at this. We're covered in muck and mud, finding treasure back in an trash. ancient cave that's going to get flooded soon and will never be seen again, except for some very brave, very brave, Scuba divers, which is not me. We're not going back in here. No. Whoa! What do you got? Joe! What, what, what? Joe, Joe, Joe! What? I see sunlight! Let's, we gotta go. We gotta go there. Yo! I see sunlight! Guys, we came way back in the cave here, so far back that it's a little bit scary, honestly. And then no way. we're about to turn around. Rich shut his flashlight off, and we could see sunlight coming out of the back of this cave. That means the back of this cave over here has a vent and it gets up to the surface. Let's Probably up into it. the woods, man. We gotta get back up in here. We're gonna go back up in there and check that out right now. Let's call Colton. Colton! Come here, we found daylight! Colton, how you doing, man? Uh, I'm doing pretty good, honestly, actually. I'm wow, doing better than I thought I was. Bro, Colton, could you ever have imagined that you'd be in Florida, way back, trying yeah. to escape out of a tiny little crack in the middle of the woods? That. You know, that, that pretty much tells you everything that I was not expecting to do in Florida. <laughs> All at once. <laughs> well, anyway, guys, way back in there, that's our escape hole. We'll climb back in here and see if we can get out of this cave, out of the back hole of this cave. Now, look, I see the line here where the scuba divers were swimming to. Uh, this is crazy, guys. I can't believe I'm doing this. Um, yeah, oh, that's good. I can see daylight, man. Mm -hmm. We're... Oh. Colton, what do you see? Uh, it looks like there's a possibility we have a collapse or something that happened. Are you happened. serious? Yeah, and that's what oh, caused this, this hole right here. Gosh, I don't know. Yo, this is scary. Don't even talk about collapse, bro. I'm about <laughs> to freak out, man. When you say collapse, dude. <laughs> I'm about to freak out, man. Okay. Yeah. Well, let's get to the air. Dude, then. when you said collapse, you just triggered some serious, like, claustrophobia, brother. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Golden, why'd you say collapse, dude? You scared, dude. Guys, we have land. Ho! <laughs> oh, my goodness. Look at this, you guys. This is crazy. Oh. Oh. If the sun had not been at the right level, we would not have used it. <sighs> Alright, so what's really good to me is that if the sun had not been at the exact level... So, so happy to see light and trees in the back of this cave. <laughs> let's get up there and let's get back out to the river. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at this. There's roots coming down in here. Best to go through the cave, Rich. Oh. Through the cave. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna get back to the river through this. Let's see it. Oh, we gotta, I gotta get up here. 
I gotta, I need some sunlight. Okay. I need some fresh air. This is crazy. He needs some sunlight oh. and fresh air. Woo! You, you guys. Panicking here. Oh man. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Oh. Sunlight. You made it. Sorry. I oh my goodness. No, that's good, brother. You were actually panicking. <laughs> that, that freaked me out, man. When you said collapse, like I thought about, oh shoot, collapse. And that just triggered something in me, man. I was like freaking out back yeah. here. I saw it. Like, you were started. legit freaking out. Oh my gosh. Uh, I mean, not really. I was getting nervous, brother. Let's just say that. This is wow. crazy. Look at this. We just came up <laughs> in this crack in the middle of the woods. This is the back of the cave, you guys unbelievable we got out here now we're in the woods but look at this the woods and the foliage is so thick in here i think i think that we're stuck and i think that we have got to go back through that cave to get back out of the river man so it was pretty sketchy coming up through the cave we got to go back we got to do it man we got to get back to the boat rich yeah what'd you see back up there i mean to be honest it was really hard to see if that went anywhere. It's just woods and woods and woods. Don't, please don't fall and break your leg here, man. I, I, I do not want to have to carry you through this cave. Okay. You're a big guy, man. I don't. All right, here we go. We're going back into the cave. What's up, man? You need a hand? What do you need? Man? I just want to make Watch sure I get no Watch your step, brother. All right. Watch your step. I think we got out alive. Okay. You All good? All right. Now we go back into the cave we're going back look at this descending down this hole it's crazy covered in mud broken rock unbelievable you guys unbelievable okay now i gotta shimmy backwards on my belly here let me get back through here oh oh my gosh oh okay Okay. Oh. Uh. Whoa, whoa. You okay? I'm good. Yeah, it's just my wetsuit's slippery, bro. I still got all the conditioner, so <laughs> the wetsuit's sliding around on my body. Can't get a grip. Oh. All right. There we go. There we go. Go in. What's up? <laughs> Ow. Oh man, that hurt. That was fantastic. Well, that was epic. All right, we're back at the raft. Thankfully, the raft did not pop, it's still holding the air. So, we're gonna be able to get back across the water and get back to our vehicles. All right, guys, check this out. We made it back out to daylight in the front of the cave. We're back out to the river and back out to our raft here. This was such an amazing adventure. I think this was a once in a lifetime experience. They're gonna flood this cave back up and we're never gonna be able to do this again. This was amazing. So I'm so glad to have shared this adventure with Rich Aloha and my buddy World of Colton. If you haven't already, check out their channels. They have some really awesome channels. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like and please consider subscribing for more great underwater content. Thanks again guys. Now get in there and explore.